Hello, welcome to Liverpool FC News Today channel. Mohamed Salah's contract extension talk seemed never ending for months, and many felt that, for that very reason, it was unlikely that the Egyptian would remain at the club. However, the Reds appear to have learned from a recent mistake to ensure they wouldn't allow another top talent to depart. It was announced last week that Salah had put pen to paper on a new three year deal at Anfield finally being granted his wish of a new deal. The former Chelsea forward was vocal in how he wanted to remain at Anfield beyond 2023 when his original contract expired. But a deal looked doubtful. Reports speculated that wages were the underlying reason why Salah's representatives and the club couldn't reach an agreement. With the proposed figure not fairly showcasing the wingers important in Merseyside. However, the Reds appear to have performed a U-turn on their original strict position in negotiations. According to The Athletic, Salah could earn close to £400,000 per week if he hits certain milestones. Thus, it certainly suggests that Jurgen Klopp and the higher powers at Liverpool may have had a rethink about their wages following the departure of Sadio Mane to Bayern Munich. The Senegal international pushed for an exit from Anfield at the end of the season with his deal expiring in 2023 as well. Reports circulated that negotiations were opened with the former Southampton Stars representatives but a deal was never reached. Writing for The Mirror, former Red Star Robbie Fowler believes the club couldn't justify his wage demands, he said, one thing is obvious. The club has done some very clear, precise and unemotional calculations with Mane. Hess 31 in April, has a huge amount of running in his legs and wanted a huge contract as one of the best players in the world. I don't blame him for that. Mane is the equal of virtually every world-class star at the moment, and rightly wanted that recognition with the going rate for the last big contract of his career. However, something appears to have clicked in Merseyside for them to have a change in heart of Salah following extended talks that consistently reached a loggerhead. Of course, it could be that Main's exit has freed up some wage budget, though it could also suggest a change in the times at Liverpool. If the Reds want to continue to sit at the top of the footballing pyramid with Manchester City then they are, as much as they can, going to have to attempt to compete financially. Thus, handing out a bumper deal to one of the best players in world football is certainly a step in the right direction on that front and may see the club change its way slightly perhaps, waving goodbye to one of the club's most important players. That has spearheaded their revival since the appointment of Klopp was enough for the penny to drop at Anfield.